Thomas Geeboy with weather. Welcome back. It's been another picture perfect day across the Wiregrass and in the Florida Panhandle. Today, just a little bit more humid and a little bit more warm, plus a little bit more cloud coverage as well as we've gone throughout today. And that'll be the case as we go throughout the rest of the next, as we go throughout the rest of this week. A few more clouds still filtering in from our east, so still watching those clouds moving in. However, that's not going to spell any rain chances for us. Just partly cloudy skies going to be around as we look out and you follow. Pretty nice backdrop there. So expect that to continue as we head into the evening hours. But today, like I said, a little bit more noticeable warmer than what we've seen the past couple days. Right now still seeing 80 degrees in Dothan, 79 degrees Geneva at 80 degrees in Troy. So that little gradual warming trend yesterday, we saw temperatures top out in the upper 70s today into the low 80s. And as we go throughout tomorrow, we'll see those high temperatures peak out into the low and mid 80s. And you can see as we go look back in the rest of the southeast and heading in towards Arkansas, a lot more warm air continuing to move in. That's showing Really not any big weather maker coming into the next four or five days. However, that'll begin to change as we begin to start next week. But as we see this gradual warming trend, that means those clouds will continue to filter in. Don't have to worry about those rain chances. So going through the overnight, expect partly cloudy skies. What the future cast is pointing out here is potential early morning fog. So there might be some visibility issues tomorrow morning. So give yourself this a little extra time as we go throughout tomorrow morning. And that'll stay constant as we go throughout the day on Friday as well. So early morning fog leading to a mostly sunny and partly sunny afternoon. But like I said, no worries about the rain, at least until we get to the latter portions of the weekend as we get into Sunday. And speaking of the future visibility, you can see about a mile, some spots in the Florida Panhandle, even less than that, Mariana coming in with zeros across the board. And like I said, this is just one of our models spitting out, spitting out this information, but that is there, there is a chance for some potential patchy fog tomorrow morning. So make sure you account for that tomorrow morning. But venturing towards the tropics, still not that much going on. Don't really have to worry about the eastern Atlantic. We've been watching one little area in the Bay of Campeche continuing and just make its way over there, but right now the National Hurricane Center has kind of forgotten about it, but we're still watching a line of thunderstorms. As we go throughout next week, that might begin to get sucked in by the upper levels of the atmosphere, and that'll bring it towards us, so we might see a little low develop. Not going to have to worry about a tropical system, but it will spell rain for us going to the mid portions of next week, but your golf cast for tomorrow should be a much better day than the last couple days. Expect better conditions. The old flags will be flying instead of the predominantly red that we have been seeing. That water temperature, though, cooling off rather quickly. Right now, 73 degrees pretty soon. is going to be a little bit too cold to get into the water, but for tonight, expect temperatures to be into the upper 50s, partly cloudy skies. That fog should build in tomorrow morning, but we should see that fog begin to mix out right around 10 o'clock tomorrow morning. So leading to a perfect afternoon and it'll be a little bit warm as well. High temperature is going to be into the mid 80s, but that sunset at 6 Oh, 2 p.m. It is getting dark and it is getting dark really, really quickly. <laughs> but if you look at the seven day forecast, warm afternoons into the weekend. Rain chances will return as we head into next Tuesday. We'll see significant rain chances Wednesday and Thursday. But overall, mm -hmm. the next couple of days looking pretty good and the weekend's looking good as well. All right. Sounds pretty good to me. Thank you. You're welcome. Surrounded by the president.